Fuzzy Bird, welcome back to Paper Mario, the Origami King. In the last episode, we defeated the Rubber Band Man in the Shogun Studios and was able to save the Shogun Studios and unleash the blue streamer. Now, we are at the yellow streamer here at Sweet Paper Valley, I think. Come on, Mario, let's follow that yellow streamer all the way through Sweet Paper Valley. And I guess we could talk to him again as well. Ahoy, what will it be? So we can go to Shogun Studios, Autumn Mountain, or ride the Ed Eddie R River Rapids. I don't think I need to do any of that right now, but good to know my options are available. And yeah, we'll just sort of get working everything here at this area. So yeah, we're beginning our journey to the yellow streamer, which I think there's five streamers in total, so this is sort of the midway point for us. Very exciting. And we're still a little banged up from uh, the boss fight, so if we could just go ahead and uh, heal now. We origami folk have a saying. For every mountain fold, there's a valley fold. It's probably about the ups and downs of life, or it could be about actually actual folding, I guess. Hard to say, I think a little bit of both. Either way, that's pretty deep and inspiring. Even a dud like me might climb up one of life's mountains someday. All right, we heal up all the way there, very nice. Yeah, I'm so glad that uh, bob -omb recovered all of his memories but still wants to stay with us. That happened last episode as well, so yeah. I hope we hear more about his memories as we move forward, because we didn't really hear too much about it. Either way, just gonna hit these boxes. Whoa, there's another hole. So a lot of holes to fill up here. We've already filled up like four or five of them. And how are we doing with our progression? Oh, that's mostly everything. Okay, there aren't any toads, question blocks, or collectibles to find around here. So a little weird. That had a lot of confetti in it. Huh, so maybe this area doesn't have too much to it. Either way, filling that up. And what else can we do around here? We also got our confetti um, bag improved so we can hold more confetti than ever, so definitely collecting as much as I can is a good idea. Oh, an entryway to a mine. Okay. That streamer just keeps going through the valley and beyond. Hmm. Looks like we'll need to go through that tunnel to reach the other side. Indeed we will. So let's go ahead and destroy all this. There we go, fill that up a little bit, and there we go. For Sweet Paper Valley, that's all the not bottomless holes repaired, and should be the entire area finish. Surprisingly easy. So what will Olivia say now? Come on, Mario, let's follow that yellow streamer all the way through Sweet Paper Valley. Okay, same thing. Oh, hello. Who said that? Oh no, it's the Origami King. Ollie. Yes, it has been a while, hasn't it? Oh, you've stolen Peach's castle, wrapped it in the streamers, crumpled up countless toads. Why must you keep doing this? It's so mean. Ah, sister, you have such a flat outlook on life. All I am doing is creating a glorious kingdom for origami like us. How can you not grasp the brilliance of and daring in my plan? A world for origami, but origami and flat paper can live together. You don't need to be so mean to these nice paper folks. It's not right, you've got to stop this right now. Very well. I thought perhaps you would listen to reason. I see I was mistaken. Ever since you teamed up with this Mario fellow, you've been nothing but a crinkle in my neck. It ends now. Uh-oh. Oh no, we're gonna be squished. Olivia, is she okay? She got flattened. You monster, why'd you do that? Consider this path closed. Alas, there'll be an empty origami throne beside me. But no matter, the birth of my origami kingdom is imminent. You may as well sit back and wait for its arrival. I don't think we get a, can move this. It's too big. Ah, the stupid boulder won't budge. There has to be something we can do. Ma'am, ma'am, are you okay under there? Mm. Uh. She's okay, but it can't be good to, to fly an origami like that. If we don't do something soon, she might be permanently crumpled. Uh-oh, what can we do? Can you explode, maybe blast the boulder open? Well, where's he going? Oh. Uh, what is he doing? You, you okay, Bobby? I, oh, yes. It is the only way. I know how to save Olivia, Big M. We have to... 
Set sail! We have to get to the port in Toad Town and set sail for the Great Sea. I know it seems crazy to leave Olivia here, but I need you to trust me, Big M. All right, Olivia, I guess we're going to the ocean. A little help. Phew, she's still hanging on uh, under there, but we've got to hurry. Let's get to Toad Town and make our way to the Great Sea. We can do this, Big M. All right, well, I'm trusting Bobby with this one because he asked me to. Let's hope this is a good idea. Oh my gosh, what a turn of events. So hopefully Olivia can hold on tight as we go out to the, the sea for whatever reason. I wish he would tell me a little bit more about his plan, but I guess we'll figure it out as we go along. All right, uh, ahoy, was there an earthquake? I heard something big. Anyhow, if you're looking to get to Toad Town, the warp pipe in Shogun Studios is way faster than Padlon. So what it'll be. Um, see, let's go to Shogun Studios so that we can take the warp pipe. Oh, look at him go, Hup! He is moving. What a pro. So yeah, that was interesting. I, I feel really bad for Olivia that she just has to hang out under there. Welcome to Shogun Studios, folks. Phew, paddling up uh, really takes it out of you. So yeah, let's get up this way real quick. And uh, oh yeah, everybody's here now, awesome. When I heard Shogun Studios had reopened, I canceled all of my plans and ran all the way here. Then I realized I forgot my wallet. At least this entrance is pretty. Please purchase your pass here, then proceed to the entrance. I don't sell the passes, I stand here all day and explain the machine that sells the passes. <laughs> all right. Welcome to Shogun Studios. So we'll definitely explore Shogun Studios a little bit more at some point. Why is admission so expensive? Let me in, let me in! Aw, oh, poor guy. Um, yeah, we'll save for right now, and I guess we'll just go on down uh, to the warp pipe. So we'll explore Toad Town a bit. I already know that the, um, the ship is open, like the port to the right of Toad Town, so we'll definitely go over that way, but yeah, things are intense now, because not only is all of, you know, Mushroom Kingdom relying on us, we also need to now save Olivia, who's sort of been our guiding light throughout most of this. Whenever we're lost, we can turn to her and she'll help us figure it out, so definitely a bit worrisome. I mean, I, I like bob on being around and stuff, but he's not really too much of a, a navigator like Olivia can be. Here we are, Toad Town. Now might be a good time to, oh, all right, Big M. Should we head straight to the port? I think we should restock on some items at the least. Um, I know I need a new shiny hammer and stuff, so we can do that. And yeah, we'll just go right over to the port after that. Hey, buddy. Hi, right, what can I get you? Please spend generously. Also, we should see, because actually, no, I have, oh, I have a decent amount of everything then. Um, maybe I could get a couple of uh, POW blocks, but beyond that, I can maybe get like one more iron boots. Yep, 300 coins. And then two more POW blocks. But also I should probably check the accessory shop and see if they have anything extra for us. Uh, they could, and if they do, we wanna make sure we take the, take advantage of that. So let's keep going. Hey buddy, so do you have anything new? Fun, funky, and functional. You want accessories? We've got accessories. So he does, he has Silver Time Plus, gives you even more time to arrange enemies in battle for 5,000. Um, sure. And then also, uh, we had the next one, Ally Tambourine. Raises attack power for all of your allies for a little bit. So I'm guessing that means like bob -omb, but maybe maybe the toads that help us out, that would be good. Um, so we'll definitely have to see what we can equip. And that's it, we're all sold out. Don't worry, we're stocking a bit. Oh, and don't forget to equip your accessories in the plus menu. So, um, if we take a look around in our accessories, instead of this one, we can just do Silver Time Plus. Uh, and I don't think, I don't think we need this one too much anymore. Oh, I probably should have been equipping this. <laughs> oh, we can equip all these. Oh no, we can equip two at one time. Interesting. I don't know why we need this pedal bag, unless it's just being cosmetic. Maybe we'll do something like that because those were two of the most utilitous options, I suppose. So yeah, with that figured out, I guess we're good to move over to the right. But have I talked to you? Life is great when you're not worried about being crumpled by terrifying monsters. I agree. But uh, yeah, we'll just keep moving over to the port. Apparently we're still having the origami festival after everything that's happened. Are we? I guess so. I heard that there were giant papery creatures eating houses. I hope they didn't eat mine. On second thought, I have 25 years left on my mortgage. <laughs> All right, well, as you can see, there is a Goomba still up there on that roof, but I don't really have a way to get to him as far as I can tell just yet. 
Either way, up this way should be the port. I do not remember this toad leaning against the pole. Tis I, the love toad, at your service, my lud. I am able to feel all of the love lost in this world. Now then. At this pre precise moment, there is no love lost. Ah, but let not your guard slip. We are but in the eye of the love tempest. So I'm pretty sure this is the guy that was talking about the hearts earlier. Maybe if we miss a health upgrade, he'll tell us about it? Probably. Ah, there's nothing like a fresh ocean breeze. I need a boat. <laughs> well, we are about to hop on a boat, apparently. Hey there. Shall we set motor for the great sea? Yes, because I think I have talked to him in the past. So he just sort of wants to get right to it. But would you look at that? We're just heading out into the ocean. What a quick turn of events. I thought we were gonna go to a valley that had like a desert theme to it. Nope, the ocean. The great sea. Wow. Here we are. Nothing but ocean for as far as we can see. Oh, and there's also another streamer. Hey, is that another streamer? These things really are everywhere. Thanks for taking me all the way out to the great sea, Big M. I've got a plan to rescue Olivia, but we'll need a special item first. It'll be found on the luxury ship, the, Prince, uh, the Princess Peach. It should still be out, out here somewhere, I hope. Once we get our hands on that item, we can save Olivia in no time. All right, so there's, there's a ship named after Princess Peach? Interesting. Well, oh, do we get to control the boat? If we sail straight from here, we should spot a huge ship. That'll be the Princess Peach. Oh, and there's some fish in the water. So yeah, we can steer the ship with Al. Oh, this is so cool. Uh, speed up by holding down ZR. Oh, wow. Uh, return to Toe Town anytime with B. And is there a map for this? Whoa, the Great Sea. So the only thing we can really find here are collectible treasures. There's no um, toads, bottomless holes. Well, yeah, weird. Um, talk. Arg! I dropped it. Sploosh! A fat sack of precious coins right into the old drink. Huh. Can we find them? Not from what I can see, but maybe later. Anyways, I do see some extra stuff going on. Like the streamer just goes plonk right into the water. Don't really know what's going on with that. Oh, there it is! Whoa! That really is a big ship. Huh. Oh, and then it pops out of the water right over here. Interesting. Bunch of fish over there too. This is it, Big M. That's the Princess Peach. Okay, can we board the ship? I guess so. This is really weird. The Princess Peach. Ah, here she is, lads. The famous cruise ship, the Princess Peach. I knew it had shipped out recently, but why is it stopped way out here? The secret to saving Olivia is on that ship, Big M. We'll find it in the VIP stateroom on the second level. Why does he know this? There's an elevator right inside the main hall. Let's head there first. Maybe he worked here? Shall we ship out? No, I just sort of wanted to talk to you. So let's see what's going on here. As you can see, we're on the Princess Peach. Toad's rescued, there's, there's a lot to do here. Um, I'm guessing, we'll find out, I guess. Uh, huh, the ship actually looks quite destroyed. Princess Peach Main Hall. Hmm, maybe we should explore the outside first, though. Just sort of take a look around and see what we can do, because stuff is turned over. Whoa, there's some cheap sheep. Gotta be careful of them. Are they gonna hop out of the water at me? Oh! Oh, wait, there we go. Ah, I couldn't get the last guy. Oh, well. <laughs> we'll take them on. And, oh, wow. The music's very intense. So I guess for this one, we just want to uh, move this cheap sheep there. I move these guys here. We should be able to handle them with just a normal hammer attack, though, so we're just gonna go for that. Ooh. Excellent. Boom, they're done for. And same thing over this way. Use some hammers. But yeah, hopefully we can make our way through the ship without too much of an issue so that we can get whatever item we need to save Olivia, but this has been very weird so far. There we go. And... Let's keep filling up the holes. I think I'm full on confetti at the moment. There we go, much better. Oh, there's 100 coins in there. 
Oh, I wonder if there's maybe like pirates or something out here. Maybe that's what happened to the ship. There we go, there's another hole filled up. And not too much else around here. Interesting that there's a swimming pool on a ship. <laughs> Just because like, you know, you're surrounded by water. Ooh, what's this? Whoa, cool. We got some extra coins back here. And some cracked windows. And a collectible treasure, right? Ooh, classic brick block, number 54. Yeah, it doesn't seem like there's too much more I can do beyond that. But good to know, one extra secret out of the way. I'm curious, now that we found one secret, how many more secrets are in this area? That was 33%, so that means there's probably two more left to find. But hey, in the meantime, let's get up here and fill up more holes. There we go. Got the one right there. Oh, okay, there we go. And it seems like there's more up this way. I, I do want to go inside the ship soon, but I just figured, let's explore the exterior first. Oh, and here's another easy collectible treasure. Oh, wow, actually, this was max up heart plus 20. Wow, that's really good. So up to 125 HP now. That's quite a lot. Oh, hey, uh-oh, fire bros. That's not good. Get him. Oh, I jumped on him, nice. So we got file, folded fire bros to take on here. Is it just one of them? And I guess I can't get a hint from Olivia. Maybe bob -Bom can help me? I don't know. No, yeah, I just don't get any hints. How do I wanna do this? Um, oh, good question. I don't know. Because you would think that, like, uh, I don't know. That's so weird. I don't know. <laughs> okay, well, we got to come up with something quick. So just do that. I mean, that doesn't line them up, but at least we can attack both of them with hammers. All right, then. So let's try that out a little bit. Um, I'm going to use a shiny hammer right here. They're probably gonna have a lot more health than this, but this'll maybe at the least get rid of the Shy Guys. Yes, okay. Come on, bob -Omb. Not bad, 30 damage from him. So that tambourine really is helping. Oh my. Oh, I didn't get multiple attacks there, though. Yikes. That definitely wasn't what I was supposed to do. Um. Okay, if it's just you, once again, I guess we'll just hit you with the uh, shiny hammer. Ooh. Oh, that was okay. But still enough to take you down. Awesome, so hopefully next run goes a little bit better. But there we go, Fire Bros taken down. There's another one. Right over here, we got him with the hammer. And boom, eight damage. So here comes a whole group of them again. Okay, so for this one, I'd imagine what I can do. That's, no wait. No, <laughs> come on. One, why is it not working? What's going on? There we go. I, that time I pressed the wrong button. Uh, there we go. Uh, two and three. That's probably what I could have done last time as well, but I was just being silly. Uh, and we will try the Hurl Hammer normally. Maybe the shiny Hurl Hammer, I don't know. Let's give it a try. Ooh. That was great, but not good. 44 damage, oh my gosh. Wow, that was really good. 629 coins for that one as well. We need as many coins as we can get because we spent a lot of them earlier. Let's also fill that up a bit. There we go, so there's another not bottomless hole. I don't think we can get any higher up on the ship though, to wherever they were. So I think that means we're good to hop down this way and go inside the main hall. So yeah, I guess this is just what we're exploring in today's episode. Whoa, not looking so good in here. Whoa, this looks even worse than I remembered. <laughs> Was it bad before? <laughs> You're probably wondering why their ship is all banged up. Long story, I'll explain it later, okay? Sure. Let's hop in the elevator and hurry to the VIP stateroom. I have a bad feeling about this place. All right, well, we'll still clean up whatever we can, fill up some holes and stuff. Oh, it's so creepy though. Oh, is there a toad around here? Oh, there is, he's all folded up. We gotta help him. There we go, oh, he's still pretty crumpled. 
Oh. Wah! Oh, he scared Bob Bomb. Dude, come on, you can't scream like that. that. Scared me half to death. I think the toad is a member of the crew here. Let's uh let him rest. He's out like like the lights. Something must have rattled him real good. Oh no. That's not a good sign. Uh, can we get some more confetti? Because I need it. Get another hole right here. This place is all ripped up, torn up. Not good. What about this? There's something behind it. Is that a Sniffit? I think it might be a fold to Sniffit. Or a Shy Guy or something. It's the Princess Peach. <laughs> this model really takes me back. I had so much fun on this ship. Bright sunshine, salty sea breeze, a horizon that seemed to stretch on forever. And my best buds. <clears throat> Sorry, Big M. This isn't the time to get caught up in the past. Olivia needs us. Let's go. Gah! Oh, I tried to get you. It didn't work. <laughs> that one guy fell too, though. <laughs> All right, so we're going to get some snippets here. Oh, a whole bunch of everybody. So, how do we want to do this? I don't know. <laughs> um. Oh, I see. No, I don't see. Oh, you know what? Yeah, we'll just do this. There we go. Perfect. So let's give this our best bet. The shy guys aren't too big of a worry. I think we can honestly get rid of them with just normal boots. Yep, I was right. And then also, over here, we'll use the shiny hammer for these guys, just in case. The sniffets are a bit tougher. Got it. 28 damage though. Definitely, we're a bit boosted right now, so it works pretty well. Last wave coming in. How are we doing this? Because I could do that, but that's better. Huh. But also not the best. Weird. Maybe we should just try that? Yeah, I don't know what to do about it. Okay, we're just gonna do this. I know it's not going to be the best, but uh, for right now, let's start this up. And that's enough to take out the shy guy. So if we can just do some good damage to the Sniffets, that'd be nice. Um, so, down this way, uh, we'll do the shiny hammer against this group, and then hopefully bob -omb can take out the other one. I got the excellent, and it's not enough to take him down, darn. Okay, well they're gonna attack now. Oh, oh, but they messed up. Well, that's good. And he's freaking out, he's calling in more friends. Oh, not what I needed. Okay, how do we wanna do this? Because I could do that. Oh, this is so weird. Um, Because once again, there's like no best answer. Weird, sometimes I feel like you just have to take the loss, you know? All right, well that's what we'll do then. I'll do that. Cause like, I don't know what I'm supposed to do about it. Uh, we will hopefully just jump on these guys with the shiny boots and that'll be enough to take down this one sniffet and then I can do a hurl hammer, maybe a shiny hurl hammer on those other guys. Still not enough to take that guy out. It's just like, oh, they're just not giving me the matchup opportunities I need. Okay, just to be safe, let's get rid of these guys like this. I got the great, which is 31 damage each still. So there's that done. Oh, come on, no, I really need you not to do that. If they call in more friends, I swear, okay. Now you're going down. Just hitting you with a normal attack. And that still might not work out. Come on, bob -omb. please attack. Yes, okay. Jeez, that was a tough battle. We get over 600 coins for it, but man, that just like never ended. Okay, so definitely grab all of that. I know, I know. Uh, yep, it sure is Princess Peach. Uh, I guess you like it, th this ship, as much as I do, eh, Big M? I'm just trying to get the coin on top. <laughs> I can't get it. Oh, well. So what's going on over here? Ship location guide. 
So we're here on the first floor deck in the main hall. So to the left is something, but this whole place is very complicated. We got the wheelhouse, the VIP stateroom, um, engine room lounge, the bow, bow, I think it's bow. Um, interesting. Where are you going, Big M? This ele the elevator to the VIP stateroom is the other way. I mean, we can try that, but I don't trust elevators in this game anymore. Twice now, they've they've fallen on us. Uh, Fruity drinks in an ocean view, Peachy Keen Lounge. Hey, I mean, if we can explore it a little bit first, I wouldn't mind. Uh, oh, there's definitely a toad over there, okay. Wow, this room got hit pretty bad. This was such a cool lounge before. You could see the entire ocean out that window. So let's go ahead and save that toad right now if we can. Might have to hop up like this way. There we go. See even the little drink container. Something pounded on the main window. Something big. It was so scary. Oh, he's scared. Something pounded on the. Okay. On the window? I guess over here. Oh my gosh. Yeah, the window's broken. And I can't quite get up there. Hmm. Do we have enough confetti to fill this up? Oh. Oh no, not again. Come on, let me attack. Let me attack. Yes, I got one of them. Better than nothing. So this is another big wave battle. Boom. Hey, it's something. Can I get a good matchup to start things off? Because this looks a tad bit complicated, but. Hmm. What are we supposed to do? Good question. Uh. Oh, you know. I was gonna say that and this, but oh my gosh, what do you do here? Uh, I, oh, come on, what do you do here? What, <laughs> come on, why are these so tough? Uh, oh my gosh, I have no clue. This is like my best bet. I don't know. Oh my gosh, they're so tough. Uh, you know what? We're using an item. I'm using a power block because I just don't want to deal with these guys doing what they're gonna do. There we go. That does eight damage to them all. Should we t try a fire flower? The fire flower. I don't know if that's gonna work as well as, I, if, as some of my other items. So for right now, if I could just do like shiny boots on these guys, maybe in com combination with the power block, it might do enough. And it does, so that's good. Bob, I'm just gonna come in, get rid of one of them. That's good too. And he's just gonna jump around because they can't they can't move, I think. Yep. Which is fine. Like that I can handle a whole lot better. Oh, here we go, here we go. Got it. They're going down, that's for sure. We're gonna use shiny boots just in case, but I think it'll take him out. Yeah, 24 damage each, that's gonna be good. These Sniffets are tough, though. And our shiny boots broke. Last wave coming in. Okay, this one's fine, this one's fine. I just do that. Oh. Well, actually, no, we're fine, because I have that move and this move. Okay. So, I'll use shiny iron boots, actually, gear, Shiny boots, right there. Perfect. <laughs> Never mind, we're good. Okay, it's our turn. And you're in trouble. And then if we just hit them with the shiny hammer over there, that should definitely be enough. Let's get them. That was a great, and that was still 26 damage, so that one was much better, and because of it, we get a 1,000 coins. Definitely the pal block helped us out. Uh, so there's that done. We have plenty of confetti back for it too. Are there any more toads to save around here? I wonder. There's not, but maybe at the least I can, uh, uh. No, can't get up that way. How do I get up there? Ah, there we go, I just had to break it. Whoa, whoa, we can break that open too. Oh my gosh. Where are you going, Big M? The elevator to the VIP room, state room is the other way. All right, maybe we'll go check that out soon since he's, he keeps telling me about it. Maybe we're missing something. Uh, 
Either way, can we even get back to where we were? Crew entrance, no unauthorized entry. Can I go through? And I'm guessing this will just be the room we were just in. No, it's not. Where are you going, being in there? Okay, okay, I know. Well, well, since he's bothering me about it every step we take, I guess we'll try that first. Maybe there's something that happens. But yeah, at least we're figuring out how to get more around the ship now. Seems like there's a lot to explore here. So here we go, we're going to the elevator. Uh, I don't like it. I don't like it. The elevator isn't working? Are you kidding me? Shoot, power must be out for the whole ship. I guess this dark, unlit room should have been our first clue. Hmm, which part of the ship controls the power? Any idea where to start, Big M? Well, probably where we were headed before you were badgering me so much, but the power source has to be on the ship somewhere. Let's keep looking around. I think it's going to be, of course, where the little lightning bolt is in the engine room, in the ship's hold. So we're gonna get down there. We were actually heading the right direction for that. So we're gonna go do that now. Uh, so we're gonna go all the way around. But does that mean I can break other windows as well that are cracked like that? I'll have to keep an eye out for it. But we're figuring out more of this ship as we move forward, which is always good. So far, it's a lot of fun exploring this, but also just very creepy. And we can go in here. So what is this about? This is the bow. Oh, right, this is the deck where... Hey, Big M, how much do you know about us bob -ombs? The life of a bob -omb is pretty short, all things considered. That's why we try to make the most of the time we have. I guess you'd understand better than most, Big M. You're risking your life to battle these folded soldiers. Ugh, listen to me. Sorry for the big monologue. Let's keep searching. No, I, I get it. So yeah, uh, making the most of your time, no matter how much life you have, it's always good to make the most of your time. But I guess he must have spent time with friends here. I guess it was just a vacation for him. Anyways, uh, yeah, we already read that. So we're good to go down this way. We've explored everything else we have access to, so. I guess I'll take you on first. Oh, no, I don't even get the chance. I tried to swing at him. Then it stopped me. Okay, more Sniffets and Shy Guys. How are we doing this one? As far as I can tell, oh, I, you know what? I think I know. Because I can, well actually, hold on, before I do that. Perfect. Okay, so with that, let me try the Hurl Hammer just normally and hope that does enough damage. I think it will. Okay. 25 damage each. And let's just hit these guys with a normal hammer. That should definitely be enough to take them out. They're just normal shy guys. I think if we just hit normal shy guys with a hammer outside of battle, it takes them out at this point. So that should be good. And it is. And there we go. Perfect battle. So we get 400 coins. So we're slowly building up our, our wallet again after spending a bunch on accessories. There we go. And apparently there was a toad somewhere around here. So yeah, we are now here. And whoa, we get a flashy hammer. An extremely strong and fancy hammer deals big damage. We have so many different hammer types now. Engine room's down that way. But then what's up here? The wheelhouse. Oh, hey, there was a toad there. Wah, I just stepped on something. Uh, ah, he's all folded. Oh, it's just another crew member. Little guy snuck up on me. This one's unconscious. These toads must have had quite a shock. So can I save him? No, he's just chilling out there. Okay, well, in the meantime, yeah, what's going on up here? This ship just keeps going. Whoa, and there's a bunch of pictures of Princess Peach. Big M, or boom. What happened? No, hey, what are you doing here? Big M, help, I'm a bomb I'm not a bonbon. Hey, leave him alone. <laughs> How mean. Anyways, let's fight this guy. So we got spikes, which is actually our first time uh, fighting spikes. Hey, watch it. How do we want to do this one? So I'm guessing. Uh, 
because I, I want to move these guys forward. Oh yeah, and then I'm fine with just doing this. Gotcha. All right, let's see how much these guys can take. We can use normal boots on these guys, no problem. But then the spikes, I might want to use, I don't know, maybe just a shiny hammer for right now. Yeah, let's go for it. Are you ready? Ooh. Excellent, 28 damage on him. Still not enough to take him down, but it does stun him. Come on, Big M, or Bob Bomb, uh, we're Big M. Oh no. Whoa, what are they doing? Oh, that did a lot of damage. Gotta be careful of that. Now finish him off, I would love to. So I think a normal hammer, if placed in the right spot, should do the job. Ooh. Got it, okay. The enemies just get tougher and tougher, don't they? Well, there's another 300 coins for us. Yeah, let's see what's going on around here. This is like some kind of machine. Did they use this stuff to run the ship? Looks complicated, even without power. And what's this? Oh, it's like an emergency. You got a lever. A lever found in the wheelhouse of Princess Peach, of the Princess Peach. A lever, what do you think it does? If it was locked up like that, it must be pretty important. Well, I'm guessing with the lightning symbol, maybe it is used for some kind of thing with the power. But look at this, oh, this is so cool. So this is like pictures of Princess Peach throughout the different Paper Mario games. So we have the top left is Paper Mario from the Nintendo 64. Um, I think the one in the middle is uh, Super Paper Mario, if I had to guess. I guess this one is Sticker Star, maybe. Uh, the one on the, I don't know. It's hard to tell because I haven't played, oh gosh, open something. Oh, it's a star, <laughs> Super Star, number 55, cool. But I haven't played Thousand Year Door too much, so I don't remember which one. Princess Peach looks like, but I think the one in the center here is Super Paper Mario. And of course, one of them would be Color Splash and Thousand Year Door, probably the bottom right one. Um, and let's check this out. Crew member priority, safety, hospitality, customer satisfaction. And of course, this one is definitely, you know, the Origami King. Cool. So let's head out of here. And I guess go into the next room. Oh, this one's locked. Something's keeping this door shut from the other side. So for right now, let's head downstairs and go to the power room. I feel bad that we have to walk over that little toad. Well, actually, maybe I, no, that was a, that was just me checking the thing there. All right, let's go down. Whoa, this area is pretty destroyed. Oh, okay, so if I press the button for uh, Olivia, I guess Bobum talks now. Do you see anything on that map that looked like a power source? Something resembling electricity? So I guess I should be doing that more often. But for right now, we got some holes to fill up, and let's fill this one. Oh gosh, it's another Sniffit, but I got the first strike on him. Okay. Oh, that's a lot of them. But actually this one, quite simple actually. First off, I will move this there, and then I'll move these guys here. So the battles are getting a little easier as we go along, that's preferred. And once again, we'll use the Hurl Hammer on these guys I need to use this one up, because we have plenty of other really good hammers sort of down the line waiting for us, but the problem is I wanna make sure that these get used first. So we're going to use a hammer on these guys as well. And that's definitely enough. And was that everybody? That was everybody. So there's some easy coins for us. Awesome, so I'll grab everything they drop, but we're gonna keep looking around. Can't do much around here. Aha, actually, we can. Grab that extra coin. And there's another hill. hole filled up. Uh, we have 75% of them, so there's still a good chunk more, but we're, we're making good progress with finding everything, I think. Aha, here's another one. There we go. So enough, this, the ship will be patched up in no time. Watch it, buddy! But I hit him there, okay, that was weird. But I got him that time. So they're just jumping up from the pipes. I don't like it. What do we got this time? Okay, this setup looks a little complicated. What am I supposed to do? Because I'd imagine, oh I see. I can do that, and this. So once again, this one looks a bit more difficult, because I think they're all Sniffits, no shy guys this time, we'll, we'll find out in a moment. But for right now, Hurl Hammer down this way. Oh, it's enough. That's all that matters. 
And yeah, these are all snippets. So shiny hammer for sure. And that's enough. Gotcha. 500 coins this time. I guess because there was no shy guys, it was just snippets. Okay, let's pull you out of there. Or actually, do it that way. Are you okay? What even was that thing? So it's terrifying, terrifying, terrifying. What's going on? What did they see? Maybe it was a sniffet. Yeah, got him. I'm tired of these guys already. Okay, let's take him on. Wow. Okay, so actually this one, we probably can solve in one move. I just gotta get this here. There we go, perfect lineup. So this should be pretty easy. Um, I'll use a normal hammer on these guys and a shiny hammer on the other guys. It'll definitely be enough. Got it. Shiny hammer, thank you very much. Boom. Okay, so as you can see, 540 coins. And that means we can keep moving forward. So I don't see too much more. I don't know what's with these weird blocks though. A little odd. Engine room, which is I think where we need to be, right? So let's figure this out. Hmm. More like hallway to the engine room. But okay. Here we are. And there's a toad nearby that needs our help. Seems like there might be a lot to this room. It's so spooky, but the thing that makes it so spooky is it's like it's suspenseful. We don't know what's so scary. And that's probably scarier than whatever it is in and of itself. Oh, and this is where we can put the lever. Huh, this seems a bit fishy. Looks like someone made this hole on purpose. Hold up, do you think that means... Ah! Oh my gosh, aha! I knew it! Folded soldiers were trying to get the drop on us. Put your folded paper, put up your fold paper, bleh, bleh. put up your folded paper, Dukes. We're gonna crumple you like yesterday's homework. Go get him, Big M. <laughs> All right, this is interesting. You don't see these enemies too often. These guys are from New Super Mario Bros. on the DS. Oh wow, that's cool. So they're new. All right, so how do we wanna take these guys on? Um, I'm thinking probably a good idea right there. And then, oh, oh no, no, oh, I see, I see. Like that, and then like this. And I don't know too much about this, these enemies, like how powerful they are or anything, so we're definitely going to use um, a Hurl Hammer here, which is starting to get a bit beat up. This might be our last use of it. Oh, let's make it worthwhile. Boom, 26 damage to each of them, and that's enough to take them down, so they have at most 16 HP. We're gonna use a shiny hammer for this one as well. And that was great, and that was also 26 HP. So let's do that one more time, come on. Yeah, I didn't even see what these guys were called. Some kind of spider. Shiny hammer broke, but we can replace it. Last wave, so there's still more coming in. What do we wanna do for this one? Oh, that would almost work. Hmm. Because I was thinking, like, if we do that, then we do this, like, it almost works? Huh. What if I did it like that instead? Oh, that's super weird. Cause there's no way I can really get it all to work. Why is that so tricky? Maybe I could. Okay, we need more time. We need more time. Jeez, this is tough. No, no, no. Oh my gosh, I'm pressing all the wrong buttons. We're just gonna go with this. Um. And then I guess something like that. It's not gonna help me too much there. But like, what? I don't know what else to do. <laughs> I have no clue. Um, so we're gonna start with. Oh, you know what? Let's get our gear out. 
We could try a fire hammer. Hammer that has been. Or we could try the flashy hammer. I want to try the fire hammer. We got this last episode. I never really got to use it. Um, so fire hammer on the scuttle bugs. Let's try this out. Ooh, whoa, that one like flashed real quick. And that didn't really do as much as I was hoping, but it is what it is. Maybe I'll just get rid of them. It's probably my best chance. But geez, that was just a tough matchup. I just didn't know the answer, but there we go. Oh, oh, come on. <laughs> He's always messing up, but I desperately needed not to. Oh my gosh. Okay, so what are we doing about this one then? There's a way to match him up. I just don't know it. Okay, wait, no, that was it, that was it. I know what to do. There we go. There we go. It was probably along the lines of what I had to do for the last one as well, I just messed it up. Anyways, we'll try shiny boots this time. And hope that's a good idea. Yep, okay, so they have no more than 24 health, I think. All right, battle bonus, 870 coins. So at least we figured it out. Boom. Oh my gosh. The machines down here are so big, but so quiet. Guess we'll have to wake everything up. Indeed we will. So first off, let's fill this up. That's enough. Cool. Generator, one, insert the starting lever. Two, turn it like there's no tomorrow. So let's try that out. And I hope we don't need a thousand fold arms or we'll be out of luck. What's this? There's an opening. See, so let's go ahead and use the lever. Oh, that lever is a perfect fit. I I guess we did it. Um, Whoa, here we go. That's it. Keep revving it up. And we're back online. Yes, the power's back. Great job, Big M. I knew you could take charge. Uh, or take charge kind of guy, <laughs> get it? Because of the electricity? Oof, was I funnier than I had, a, I had amnesia? <laughs> I hope this means the elevator is running again. Let's head back to the main hall and find out. I guess, yeah, we'll go and do that. I can't get up this way though. But you know what? I do see a little hole in the rope there. Maybe I could just go through. Oh no. Whoa, that jolt. It can't be. I'm well, be in real trouble in here, Big M. We have to hurry to that VIP stateroom. Let's grab what we came for, then get get the heck off this ship. All right, let's save for right now. And like I said, we can actually just slip right down there. I can't quite run up there. Hmm. We'll figure it out in just a moment. Right now, fill some of that up. Oh, there's a little toad over here. That's right, we needed to save one, so. And that's all the not bottomless holes. Oh, ah, I gotcha. Mario, it's terrible, there was a crisis. There still is a crisis. I've been stuck here in the whole the whole time, so I don't really know the, the details, but crisis! Okay, did you feel that huge jolt? That can only mean one thing, an even bigger crisis, ah! All right, calm down. It's gotta take everything one step at a time. But over this way, let's get some easy stuff, just like that. Okay, well that's cool, glad we got more done. And apparently we got all of the not bottomless holes in this ship, so that's actually pretty good to get done. It's usually the easiest thing to complete out of all the different completion markers, but hey, progress is progress, is it not? All right, what is that? Oh my gosh, I don't know. I don't have a good feeling about this now. Oh man! Black Goop, oh no, we're definitely in trouble. Quick, Big M, we've gotta move. Oh no. Is it what I think it is? Black Sludge, I can't believe it's back to terrifying, terrifying! Oh no. Well, let's get up here and see for ourselves what monster has appeared to take this ship back down. And can we go up this way and do any more? Still can't help you. I don't know if that even counts as a toad saved, because it's not ringing the bell anymore. I don't think there's gonna be anything more happening here, but we might as well check it out. Oh, I used to, the, to dream of being a ship captain. Ooh, or an admiral. I bet I'd be pretty cool admiral. But I guess we just can't do anything with it. Oh, we can do something here. Oh, it's a coffee machine. 
Enjoy a cup of delicious peach tea, Captain. Oh, it's tea. Oh wow, full heal. Well, good to know that's there. We'll make the most of that. And what about inside of this way? Still locked. So for right now, I guess we're good to go back to the main part of the ship. Because I think the only thing, other thing we couldn't access because the power was off was the elevator. So we're just gonna go over there and do that now. See, so let's go over this way. The music is still pretty intense though, so I don't know what's going on with that. Oh wow, the lights are on, on in here, which makes it much nicer. Okay, the power's back. Quick, into the elevator. Oh yeah, are you awake yet? He's out like lights. All right then. Why is that? Well, the lights aren't out anymore. Anyways, uh, let's go over this way and try out the elevator. It works like a charm. Oh no. Oh no, look at it in the window, what's going on? Oh boy. Oh, this place is a mess. Oh no, it's already here. That's the door to the VIP stateroom. Hurry, get inside. Quick, the VIP stateroom is through that fancy door. Okay, before we do, gotta get myself a question block, and that's all the question blocks hit. We get a shiny iron boot for that. But what's this way? I can't go that way. Hmm. And what's over here? Oh, there's something, all right. Oh, you're all covered in sludge. I gotcha. Ah, help! This black gunk blasted through the window out of nowhere. I'll never be able to wash this off. Oh, I hate the sea. Ah, help. Okay, he's just gonna say the same thing again. I, I might as well fight this guy. Boop. <laughs> So he's blocking the door. I'm pretty sure this is the hallway that has um, princess, the, the Princess Peach room, or the, just like the main captain's hall, I suppose. Okay, what are we doing for this one? Oh, I see, I think. We're doing that. But, is now a good time to move them like that? Because that's where it gets so tricky. I just don't know how I would move them over in a way that's gonna work. Because none of that's gonna help. I don't know. You know, because I can do this, and then if I could just move them closer, that'd be fantastic. But I only have one move left. Ooh, that's frustrating, because it's just, I don't know what the answer is. We're just gonna do that. Okay, better than nothing, I suppose. Uh, Hurl hammer for these guys, for sure. All right. Here's our turn. And that does not do as much damage as I really needed it to do. <laughs> uh, and I guess I could just jump on them. I need to get rid of as many of them as possible, so getting rid of three of them right now would be the best bet. And bob -omb's gonna help a little bit. 30 damage is enough to take one of them down. So there's only three remaining. And we blocked it, so that's at least good. Okay, finish him off. I would love to. Move him to the shiny boots. And that's enough to take him down. Excellent. So yeah, not too much of a battle bonus that time, but it is what it is. Okay, so now we can open that door and go back that way if we wanted to. I'm not worrying about it. Instead, we are going through this big fancy door, like bob -omb said. Oh, this doesn't look so bad. There it is, Big M, that yellow box. Okay. Oh, it's, oh, I don't even need to heal, Never mind. I put it in this lock box to keep it safe. Oh, what was the code? Come on, brain, think, think. Uh-oh. Oh no, here we go again. What is behind that window? There's three of them. Ah! The noodles, the tentacles, and they took the box. Hey, give that back! We have to get that box back. That monster is probably on the ship's bow. Let's chase after it. I definitely will. So I actually don't need this. I might as well take it. He's so mad, he's looking intense. We have to take my lockbox back from that big jerk on the bow. Check the ship's map if you're lost, Big M. 
and we will do exactly just that. But first, I wanted to uh, look around this area a little bit. Not too much going on, because I mean, we have everything except for the collectible treasures, I think. Uh, anyways, let's ride the elevator again. But that might be who I think it is. I'm gonna hold on and we'll wait and see, but I'm pretty sure I know who this is. Oh boy, let's keep going. Run, run, run. So where's he getting off to now? Apparently on the bow, which is out this way. But what was in that lockbox? I wonder, like I'm so curious about that. Like, what did, what did bob -Om have going on before his amnesia? Just like, what was his life like? Oh, let's definitely save. Oh, we have the chance. All right. Where is he? Oh my, it's just a tentacle. Hey, get back here. Oh no. Oh no, it's true. It's Gooper Blooper. Oh man, there it is. There's the awful Gooper Blooper that roughed me up. Oh, what a jerk. Let him have a big M. Olivia's counting on us. Oh my gosh. Well, what do we do? Move, move, move. Ah. So this isn't even like a normal boss battle. This is weird. Okay, so we're gonna have to jump. Oh, not bad. So we gotta hit him in those tentacles. But also jump over the big splash he ends up making. Mm, not bad. Okay, what's next? He has so many tentacles though. Hard to keep up with. Oh no. Got it. Oh, the double though. We're getting lots of coins for it too, so that's nice. He didn't like that, huh? Oh no, here comes a bunch more of the goop. But of course, we've dealt with a couple of bloopers back in the original Paper Mario. <laughs> oh boy. Got it. Got it. Oh, more coming in. No, I missed that one, darn. Ah, oh, yeah, getting knocked back like that sort of messed me up. That's okay, that's okay. There's still plenty of ah chances to do something. Maybe. You just gotta be careful with the actual goop. What do you know? Because it will, <laughs> it will slow you down. Got it, got it. There we go. Oh, and we get a heal there. So his tentacles have been knocked off. He's not happy about that one. Can I hit him in his eye? Ooh. Apparently there was a toad somewhere? I don't know. Oh my gosh, watch it. Oh, got him again. Jump over those. Come on, one more time. It's not working. It's not working. Ow. Oh, now he's dizzy from spinning around so much, but I can't reach him, the water's in the way. Come on! Yeah, there we go! Come on, got him. He's not so happy about it. Oh no, oh no, don't you dare. So you just, you can't really hit him when he's revving up an attack like that. Yeah, it doesn't do anything. Okay, what he's gonna do is super spin again. And if I can dodge this one properly, boom, going for that hit. And there we go, we got him. He's holding up a little truce flag. See you, Gooper Blooper, and whoa, a bunch of toads were saved. I think there was a captain in there too. Wow, we did it. That was something else. Big M. That was incredible. I knew you'd wild that thing. Looks like the lockbox survived too, thank goodness. Now, let's plug in that security code and bob -omb got a super important Olivia saving item. Ta-da-da-da! <laughs> now we'll be able to rescue Olivia. Thank you, Mario. I'm Captain of the Princess Peach. Toot toot. It was dark and scary inside that beast, but at no point did I sob fully and uncontrollably. Any fibs stating otherwise are just that, dirty, mutinous fibs. Toot toot. This ship was full of passengers, but what we helped them escape in lifeboats and pr preserve customer to preserve customer satisfaction. That's great. That means the rest of the crew and passengers are all safe somewhere. Phew. Speaking of, let's head back to Sweet Paper Valley and rescue Olivia. Come on, Big M. Well, I definitely will do that soon, but it looks like we fully completed this area then. Take a look at the map. Well, actually, no, we're still waiting for one more collectible treasure. Huh. I wonder where that could be. So everybody's saying thank you. That's sweet of them. I hope all of our passengers are safe out there on the Great Sea. Toot toot. So with that being said, I guess that maybe at some point we could go out to the Great Sea and find them all, help rescue them. That might be good. With also that being said, where could this last treasure be? I'm thinking there must be a way to get up to a third 
floor, right? Well, that was the roof deck, which we already were at. So where is this final collectible treasure at? So this toad is back, he's not on the staircase anymore. I fell asleep on the job and had a terrifying dream that I was reborn as a doormat. I know it was just a dream, so why does it feel like someone stomped all over my face? <laughs> Sorry, you were sorta of in the way. So I mean, there's a couple of toads to talk to, but I don't really know if there's anything more than that. I know there was a passed out guy over this way. Um, maybe we can return at some point and of course try to take a look for this collectible treasure, but I am happy with everything we got done in today's episode, it was a lot of fun. This elevator goes straight to the VIP state room on the second floor. If you're not in a rush, you can stop by our lounge for a refreshing fruit juice or two, or three. <laughs> All right then, so we now have the item that will save Olivia, so we'll have to go back to Sweet Paper Valley and do that in the next episode of, oh wait, hold on, Mario Tutut! <laughs> we need to rescue the passengers that abandoned, uh, that abandoned the ship, uh, but there's too much fog out there on the Great Sea. If you see that fog has lifted, will you come and let us know, please, Tutut? -toot? Will do, so I guess we can go out and talk um, or find the extra hidden passengers. Uh, we need to rescue the passengers of the abandoned ship, but there's too much fog on the Great Sea. All right then, so yeah, we'll definitely get to all that and more in the next episode of Paper Mario, the Origami King. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you next time, bye bye.